hey guys i sold volatility 50 index at this point i took a sell trade here and this signal was shared as well we are not moving in profit yet but i'm expecting this index to sell from this zone i got my stop loss at this point so what was my market analysis what's my view on this index what made me sell this index and what's giving me the confidence that this index is going to sell you'll be having a look on all of that in today's video right so coming to the weekly time frame on volatility 50 index we can see that this index has been on a downtrend when we zoom out on the chart we can see the overall market direction here we can be able to say that this index has been creating series of we can be able to say that this we can be able to say that this index has been creating series of lower highs and lower lows heading to the downside so i identified this market direction we had a key level at this zone and we are kind of getting a retest of this broken level this upward move on the weekly time frame is a retest of this broken level so we're expecting this index to sell from that current price level to the downside the sales is expected so when i identified the market direction on the weekly time frame which we've seen that this index is on a downtrend we got this little uptrend move here got price create this little higher highs and higher lows formation at this point let's put this market structure we got the first low here this is the first low we got the second low at this point a higher low we got another low here a higher low this is the third higher low we got at this point so after these higher lows we can see that there was a break of structure here there was a break of structure price failed to create a new higher low right we got this level taken out we got this third higher low taken out at this point there was a break of structure here which price pushed to the upside to come test this level to come test this identified level and we got this head and shoulders pattern formation which is a bearish reversal pattern formation we got the left shoulder there we got the head at this point and we got the right shoulder at this zone so after this head and shoulder spot formation we got price sell to the downside now pushed back to the upside to come test this level this identified key level and the retest we got at this point is an uptrend move on a lower time frame when we go to the time frame we can see that we got v50 index move in an uptrend like give an upward market direction here All right we got price create series of higher highs and higher lows at this point so this is the current market structure basically market is now uptrend we can see and the sales is expected from this current price level to the downside i'm expecting this index to sell in the coming weeks and months right so after i identified this uptrend that's the test we saw on the weekly time frame i spotted it then went to a lower time frame at this level at this zone because this is our current price zone this is our point of focus on this index so i went to the forward time frame and saw that this index has been consolidating on the forward time frame for some time now so i spotted the highs and lows of this consolidation we got the lows at this point our consolidation support level and we got our highs at this zone guys right, this point we got this blue line identified as our consolidation resistance level and we can tell that whenever price gets to this consolidation support and resistance level it sells and buys from it we got the buys here as a support right we got the buys at this point as a support and the buys at this zone the third time at a as a support and if in any way price is to sell to the downside my first point of target is at this point that's my general cp level on this index because there's a possibility of price reaction from this identified zone we can see we're already moving in profit now i'm moving in profit already the sales is still expected on this index more sales expected so i told you guys so when you go back to the forward time frame right we got this level identified so if price is to sell to this identified level that would be our point of target firstly because we're likely to get a reaction from this zone i've been seeing price sell from this level of resistance this horizontal resistance level our consolidation resistance level right the first cells are the second cells and the third cells at this point the fourth cells here too so this market structure on the fourth after the current market structure i'm expecting price to sell from this current price level to the downside because we've seen the last move here which was the buy move to this level and whenever price gets to this level of support it buys from it whenever price gets to this level of resistance it sells from it so currently we're on the sales from this level of resistance so this sales is to complete here on approach to this level so on the one hour time frame everything is looking good so i got my entry on the close of this candlestick on the one hour time frame i got my entry here i took my sales had multiple positions entered here my stop loss at this point i will see this market direction already price already creating this lower highs formation which is a very structure the first highs here yeah it's the first highs at this point and another high here but we didn't really get to this highs test our trend 
line points right the second high is there the third high at this point and the fourth highs which tested our change resistance at this zone so the sales is expected on getting this lower highs formation which is likely to push price to the downside to come test this key level this identified zone on this index so more sales expected on u50 index i'm likely to hold this index for some time for days would say to run up to this our point of target so that's it guys that's i was able to take the sell trade on the volatility 50 index that's why i'm holding the sell trade on this index more sales expected on this index so that's it guys hit the like button for more trade reviews like and market analysis don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel and to my tiny viewers i appreciate the support for engaging my videos it really means a lot guys let's do more and have enough day.